Hello everyone. How are you doing today? Are you ready for a story? Go Plus Train Ride. That is going to be today's story. The author of this story is Timira Gupta and the illustrator is Parmita Mukherjee. And the publisher of this book is Pratham Books. Every Wednesday, my tummy picks me up from school. Tummy says that trains are the fastest way to travel in this city. So, tummy means grandmother in Bengali. Go blues. Grandmother picks him up from school every Wednesday and she says that Taking the train is the fastest way in the city. So they're going to travel somewhere. They, they are going to go home taking the train. So that's why the story's name is Gopalu's train ride. Let's see what happens during the train ride. Tummy smiles at everyone, even strangers. She says if you smile at people, they smile back. That's true, right? If you smile at someone, they will smile back at you. So that's what Tummy says. Even if it is strangers, she's okay. She goes and smiles at them. Sunil uncle is Tummy's friend. He always gives me a toffee through the holes in the grill. This is Sunil uncle. Sunil uncle is a friend of Tummy. What does uh, Sunil uncle do? Every time they go to his place, so he gives a, a toffee to go blue. Trains have grills too. I put each finger in one square and hold on tight as the train sets off. So we saw a grill in Sunil uncle's counter as well. And there are grills in the train compartment too. So what does Gopalu do? Of course the trains are usually crowded and when it goes past it's tough to maintain balance. So he holds on to the, to the grills. Grills are, look at these, steel meshes. So he holds on to them. He puts his fingers into the square uh, region where he can uh, hold on to it. So that even if it goes very fast and if it is very crowded, he will still have the balance. Inside the train, aunties do all kinds of things. They cut vegetables, they knit sweaters. Ah, looks like nobody wants to waste the travel time. People who regularly travel by train or bus, what do they do? They don't want to waste that. So what, what does Gopalu see? He's seeing someone chopping vegetables. So they can save some time, right? So she look at, look, this lady is shopping vegetables. And this lady is busy knitting a sweater. She's making a sweater. So people are doing something productive so that they don't waste their travel time. They put on makeup. Some even sleep, sitting up straight. Someone didn't have the time at home to finish putting on makeup so she does that in the train and there is someone who didn't catch enough sleep she didn't sleep enough so she feels that instead of just sitting in the train she could as well sleep and get some rest there seem to be fewer people on our side of the grill more and more aunties get into the other side so this is one part of the compartment where Gopalu is and he sees that a lot of people are getting into the other side of the grill. There are a lot of people. It is getting crowded, if you see. I see a little girl on the other side of the grill. Will she be my friend? I give her a shy smile. So he sees that there is a, a little girl on the other side of the grill. So look, this is her. And he is thinking. Will she be my friend? So he wants to see if she will be his friend. So he gives a shy smile. 
He's not sure whether to smile nicely or not. So he shyly smiles at her. And she smiles back. Tammy was right. I turned to tell Tammy about my new smile friend. He's very happy. Gopal is extremely happy. Because the little girl on the other side smiled back. So he knows now that he has a, a friend. So he wanted to tell Tammy about it, his grandma about, about it. But Tammy is busy. She's taking out my snack from a box. Today, there is a luchi jam roll, my favorite. But Tammy is busy. He wanted to tell about his friend, but Tammy is busy getting food from his tiffin box. What does he have? In the snack box, he has luchi jam roll. Luchi is puri in Bengali. They put jam inside and rolled up a puri. And that is his favorite snack, it seems. So she's taking that out and giving it to him. I turn to show it to my friend. She has a packet of chips. We smile as she passes me one tiny chip. So the friend on the other side, he shows his luchi roll. Immediately, what does she do? She's having a a small packet of chips and she takes one chip and gives it through the grill. Tummy tears a piece of the luchi jam roll but it doesn't go through the squares of the grill. Immediately Tummy, the grandma reciprocates. She says she picks up a piece from the, uh, the puri roll and tries to give it through the grill but the grill hole is very small. It doesn't get into that. Our station is here. I'm sad that I could not share anything with my new friend. Just then, Tummy taps my pocket. I remember Sunil uncle's gift. Ah, Tummy is clever. Immediately, the, the station has come up. And they have to get down. And he feels bad that he's, he was not able to share anything with that little girl. So then Tammy remembers and she points at his pocket. And what does he have? The toffee that Sunil uncle had given. I fish out my favorite toffee and I quickly give it to my friend. She smiles. I smile back and get off the train. He tries to locate the toffee. He has other things in his pocket. So he tries to pull the toffee out. And it is his favorite toffee. So And he gives the little girl. And she smiles. Uh, Gopal and his grandma get off the train. See, they are out in, in the station walking down the stairs. Let's look at some of the difficult words that we saw in today's story. Toffee. Toffee means hard candy. It is not a chocolate made of out of cocoa, but it is a hard can candy that you get, right? The orange ones that taste like orange, the sugar candies are called toffees. Knit. To make something with wool using two long needles. In the story, you saw that the lady was knitting a sweater. You can make a, make a sweater or a shawl or anything out of socks. All those woolen stuff that you make with two long needles. That's called knit. Luchi. Luchi is puris. Puris are called luchi in Bengali. Fish out. Search and take it out. Try this. Grandmother is called tammi in Bengali. How do you call your grandmother in your mother tongue? Do you know how to say grandmother in any other language? Have you made any friends while traveling in a bus or a train? Write about your experience. Did you like today's story? It was a very sweet one, right? I hope you really enjoyed today's story. Until next time, this is Bye from Soumya.